the first one I've got up is the one with, I think it's Natasha as the model. Yes. Um, yeah, so I mean, you. yeah, it's, it's uh, I'm, I'm happy for you to talk us through that. I mean, what was the kind of, was there like a big idea behind that when it looks very kind of 70s with the clothing and all that sort of stuff? Yeah, we were just testing really. We had a bunch of different clothes that she brought and um, a stylist brought, but we decided to use that pair of jeans and that jacket. She basically arrived to the studio with that particular outfit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you know, that's very, that's very, that's very interesting. You know, when model enters the studio and she is dressed in such ways. I'm not saying that you have to please the, the photographer or the idea of the shoot, the way you dress before the shoot. But I don't know, I just felt like it's so, it's so, so much of her, like it, it felt natural. Mm -hmm. So we ran through different outfits during the shoot. There was like four or five different maybe. And then I just looked back and her clothes were hanging on the hanger. And I said, can you just like, can we just use your clothes? And she was like, yeah, perfectly. All right with it. Yeah. So yeah, then all this came out. And, and there is other picture actually, one of my favorite from that shoot where she's just, she's just having this, uh, what is it like? Uh, what, what, is, what is that thing really like? Like, uh, lost for words. Now you gotta help me here, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, which, uh, which it's, image are you talking about? It's like, a, it's like, a, you know the, the 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 cooler sort of thing. Oh, the fan, the fan. Fan, yeah. yeah she's Thank holding you. the fan, not the guitar. <laughs> Thank you, David. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's so yeah. So she grabbed that thing and 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 she started to play with it. You know, like singing into it, like it's a microphone. And I said, "What if you do like a guitar thing?" And actually, we had the radio, you know, full on, and and they played the. Uh, I think it was. Lenny Kravitz song or Jimi Hendrix, one of those. I don't know. I think Jimi Hendrix because the guitar thing. Yeah. So he just grabbed it, grabbed it like guitar and actually started enjoying herself like full motion. <laughs> <laughs> well, funny you mentioned because I was I actually got on my notes. I was going to ask you about that image as well because it's the same with like the pose she's doing. Was she, was that just natural from her? Were you directing that? Like same with the guitar as well. I'm guessing that was just something that she just kind of did and you went. I think. I think it was like 70 to 30% her natural thing and a little bit of influence of mine because I felt like she wanna go off the, you know, she wanna go free, she wanna try things, she wanna enjoy herself there. Mm -hmm. But she sort of was looking at me and waiting, you know, am I gonna allow it? And it took for me to realize that she's, she's a bit waiting for it, you know, like backing off and I was like, yeah, that's why we are here for, you know, do all the crazy shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So like, okay. And then she started, you know, whatever. <laughs> so do you like that with, with shoots, that kind of spon spontaneity and you've got, you're not too Absolutely. rigid. You, you want uh, something from the model as well, that kind of thing. You know, it's not like, it depends. Some people are very quiet and, and, and kind of distant, you know, it depends what kind of day they are having or what kind of week they are having, you know, all that really, really drives the, the mood. But for me, it's really inspiring when people just enjoying themselves, being themselves and just like, almost like if they're alone at home, you know, mm -hmm. you all kind of stuff. The more you do, the more free you are, you know, it gives more opportunity to really capture those iconic pictures. Yeah. That's what we are hunting for, you know? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what a lot of people say as well is that, you can try and force it as much as you want, but a lot of the time it is it is the stuff that's just more natural that happens that exactly. comes across in the images and you can see exactly. that really. It's it's really depends on how comfortable people feel in the place because you know you might be using that particular studio for a while, so it feels like your home. Mm -hmm. But for some people, you know, they're coming to that space first time. So it takes like 40 minutes to really scan everything, you know, start feeling a little bit more like yourself. It's a very natural thing, but I just love when people enjoying themselves and just gives me memories. You know, I, I will never forget that shoot. It was supposed to be just like two, three hour test shoot. And yeah, it was just good fun. And, and I'm happy I, I got to know Natasha a little bit. She's a she's a very nice human being. Yeah. Yeah. It looked like a fun shoot as well. It, it comes across in the images. So you can really see that. 